Hi everyone, this is our first scratch tutorial um, with me and my dad. Hello everyone. So <laughs> I'm Grace's dad. <laughs> so um, we're going to be making a multiplayer game. And um, well, basically, we're just going to explain more of how it works and stuff, and maybe we'll do like a quick little thing at the end of how you do it. But we're going to very well explain the code. Well, hopefully, we're very well explain. Yeah. And this is that it Should we show them how it works? Uh, first, let's show them the game, how. right? Yeah. Okay. So um, we already set it up. So basically, what how it works is um, so I'm the dad here. We're both on. I can't move. It's, oh yeah, there we go. Okay, so um, we so. Um, through cloud variables, we can um, I can move, and then he can see it on his computer, and you'll see him move. That's actually him moving. Right now, that's him moving, and I can go. Whoa! Hi, Daddy. Hi, Grace. Hi. Do it would be really cool if you use this like with like chat? That would be really cool. But uh, we don't know how to do that yet, yeah. <laughs> so we can't do that. But um, that would be really cool. But anyway, so um. Should we do, do you want to explain cloud cloud variables work? Okay. So how it works is basically through cloud variables. Um, it stores the X and Y in cloud variables. And if you don't want to know what a cloud variable is, um, you can I'll show them. Should I, what should I say? Maybe you'd show a new project? Would it okay. quickly, quickly show well, I, you? I actually have some, I actually have a thing that you can see it. Okay. Uh, um, it's like a watch what I do. And it's, it's pretty simple code. Um, to watch what others do, it's in your shared, shared, um, watch what I do in real time. Okay. So, um, anybody, it says Grace website, not online, I have to change that. I just click on that and see it goes away, magical. Okay, um, um, so how the code works is, um, is it says, if the, if the username is me, so they basically only I can control it. Because I'm not actually sure how it would be if multiple people were controlling it. It might be kind of oogly. So, um... <laughs> <laughs> That's a technical term, right? Yeah, technical term, oogly. <laughs> Whenever something goes wrong, right. it's oogly. <laughs> now I know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> um, so, it's... You change the... It's a cloud... It's so, cloud variables um, store it to the server. So, anybody can see it go. And actually found... Um, I checked it and it's it's in real time. So then you can it goes so as the up arrows change, it changes the um y position. So uh, no, not the y position. <laughs> I'm getting all confused. <laughs> oh no, the up arrows can change y, right? In the it changes the, the y variable. Okay. So then on anybody's computer, it's always changing this variable and on but only I can change the variable and then on their computer it um it's only if Grace website is yeah. it's so it's, it's only allows username. you to control it, yeah, right? My, yeah. So then if it, and then it goes to the variable, the cloud variable X and the cloud variable Y, and these change. And the, so cloud, yeah, again, yeah, cloud variables are stored on the server, so anybody can see it move. So that's how this works. And then so. how does it draw it? Do how does it change where it draws it? So that's that code that you're showing there is is what's changing the X and Y based on your arrow keys. And what's the code? How does it Change. It goes to the the cloud variable X. Oh, go to. Okay, yep. And then it goes to the cloud variable Y. And so anybody viewing that is still in the same forever loop. Mm -hmm. It's just that they can't change it. They can't change it. Oh, that's that's really very really cool. You could also do it um, if you just have this. That'll work the same way. But it's it just it's just a bigger block of code. Right. Like this way, so. That's that's interesting. So now we we've, yeah. we've learned how cloud variable works. How can you explain the code that showed that multiplayer and how that yes. uses cloud variables? So um, we've got to play with others. It's modified three minutes ago, so I just finished it. <laughs> and now I <I've laughs> actually we just changed the sprites up. I need so bit so also what sometimes can happen is we forgot to hit the logout. So I'll show you some of the code. So um, when it goes in, it it's, it sets the players in, up and everything, but then there's no way to know when the stop sign is clicked. So then um, it, it it can't unset it. So you kind of have to hit log out, or it'll all get jammed up. So hit log out. And yours. Okay. okay. So now we just need to restart it and stuff. It should work. Okay. Now it's that that yeah. Here we go. This should work. 
Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So um, we got it working again. Okay. So remember to log out now. Log out. Should I log out? Okay. Yes. Log out. I'm logged out. We have two out. computers open, by the way. So that's why we're kind of talking like, yeah. So we're legit. <laughs> yeah, <there's> two computers. <laughs> so um. So basically, how it works is on the same concepts, but um, this time it says if player one equals username. So how that's determined is, so, okay. So I'll say I'll show you the cloud variables. I'll just put them all up just so you can see them all. Okay, <laughs> there's a lot, and I, it actually I just recently found that there's actually a limit of so one two three four five yeah there's one only there's one two three four five six cloud variables in this project. And how many cloud variables can you have all together? Um, ten per user. So I actually uh, had to go and delete some cloud variables in my other project. So that's why it's not work. One of my projects isn't working. So, uh oh. <laughs> anyway, um, so let's just take these away for now. The, this is what stores the X and Y, the player 1X and the player 2Y. But how the players are determined is when, when you log on, so if I log off and then I log on, when you log on, it sets the player 1 to 1, so no one can take up the, no one else can take up the player 1. Then when you log out, it sets the player 1 to 0. And then, so, and then what happened, and then, so, what, and then it, it can only come back on if you click restart it. Oh, that's clever. So if, some, yeah. if somebody's on, they take up player one. So the next person that comes on, that's how they can determine player yeah. two. So okay. then, but there's only two players, so yeah. I, I, I'm... That's enough. <laughs> yeah, that's enough, because no one's going to view this, right. really. So if um, player one equals zero, then it sets the player one to the username. So the player one... So it sets the player the player one, which is not cloud variable. Because cloud variable, I would have set the cloud variable to, like, the, the username, except for cloud variables can only store numbers. So I set the player one, to, which is not a cloud variable, to username, so you could see yourself as player one. And then I set the player one to um to one because I because That's I wanted to make sure no one else could take up that slot. So then I set the player then I set the player one to other. Wait, if no, that's if that's if um that's if so. I, I I should really name this something different because this is really confusing. The the player one and then player one. Uh, okay. <laughs> so player one, not cloud. That's how I'll refer uh, okay. to it. Oh, that's player true. one, not cloud. Okay. So, and where's the player two, not cloud? Uh, this it's just player two. I'll just rename okay. that quickly. Rename player two, not cloud. Okay, that okay. makes it clear. Yeah. So now. It sets the player to not cloud to username, and it sets the player one to one, so no one else can take it. Then, if it's if the player one um, is is taken, then it sets player one not cloud to other, so you can show it, so it shows up as other. Yeah, because you don't know the yeah. other person's name, right? You yeah. just know that it's not you. Because I can't store that into a right. cloud variable. I mean, technically, I think you could yeah. if you if they if a cloud variable numbers and like. Then you like decode it or something, okay. but I didn't know how to do right, that. I'm right. not that advanced. So then, <laughs> yeah. I'm not that That's advanced. That's for a future video. That's for we'll fu figure it out. Future video, maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe <laughs> if, you're, if you're lucky, if you're good. <laughs> <laughs> if you comment on this one, yeah, right, you, and you like it, and you decide that. <laughs> 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 okay, so if player two is zero, if it's if player two is not taken, then it sets the player two not cloud to your username in the player two to one. So it says yes, that's so it's how somebody took it. Then it sets and then if it's if player two isn't taken, is t is taken, then you set that to other. So um that's how it that's like the and it's gonna I said That's player, how you can yeah. tell how you log so in. First you're gonna get player one. Right. Then if that's if player one is taken you're gonna get player two. Right. And so, if you're player one you, you would just have to wait there until somebody else comes in. Yeah. Right. Or re and kind of refresh it right. occasionally. Right. So, um, so. So on. that's how that's how the login works. How does the um, actual game work? Where we? Well, it's, is it similar to what we you, you explained before with the? Uh, very similar. So, um, it's it says set it to player one X and player two Y, and these are going to be, and uh, if another play if previous player put it up here, that's where it's going to start. There's no, oh, it okay. doesn't refresh at all. So, um. It's just gonna go so as soon as you come, if somebody was moving around on their own before a player came in, as soon as that second player came in, he would see the other player in their position. Yeah, and then if, oh, he, got, cool. if he got access, he would start from the position he left. Off. Right, okay. So now it sets 
and then if the player one, not cloud, <laughs> player one yep. equals username. So we set it to if, if it's if it's if it's not taken, we set it to username. Oh, so if okay. it equals the username, then it's going to go through this loop, and you know, for player two, then it's does the same thing. But so then, if the up arrow is pressed, it press just sets the player one y, player one y, and player one y to negative one. We're not set it changes. Right. And then it, so basically it works on the same concepts. So um, then it sets player two x and player two y to like. Different um it, no never mind I, I was getting confused there yeah um, it, you're, doing, it, it you're, you're basically same. doing the same thing for yeah. each player right yeah it's and just it just uses whether the n username is is you or the username yeah. is the other one right I'll have to make the layout work a little better and and so in the restart also but basically just it just kind of checks to see which players are you and then it and then it um and then depending on that it takes the um, right so if you if you're if for whatever player you are, it allows you to move the, their X and Y coordinates with the with the arrow keys, and and whoever if the other player gets to just move his one. That's how you protect yes. against each player moving just their own their own sprite, right? Well, actually, this is only like this is for the layout. It only makes sure, it may just makes sure you're logging out your sprite. Oh, okay, okay. So then, if we go to restart, it just basically restarts. It, Both of them. It either, either, no matter what. Yeah, so the game I mean, might have got a little messed up. Or. Yeah, it's pretty much point. Like, it should only be accessed if, like, if I'm the one doing it. Because basically now everybody can just do it. So it's kind of pointless. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'll eventually add that. But right now there's not a lot of people on it. Like, the only people are me. So right. I don't really And have me. To, and, and, and him. So, do you think we make, like, a little practice game? Uh, if you want. Okay. I only have a few like cloud variables that I can do. So just something really, really yeah. simple. So because you explain the game very well. Yeah. yeah. So if you want, you can make like a. We can do it so it it stores. Just do the, a real quick one. Yeah, I can yeah. store the x and y. Yeah. So forever. So make a variable. So cloud x cloud y. Okay, I, I bet if um, multiple players could control it and like a lot of people were on, it would get like when you're like have a, someone has a mouse like a real mouse and then you're like trying to control it with, right. like the keypad and then it gets really annoying and then you yell at them. <laughs> so it would, it would be you really, don't want that. No, <laughs> yeah. no, you don't. You want it to be. You want to be nice. Game. You want to be like a nice game, right. calm game. Right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so it it's going to so it's going to set. Maybe we could just have a go to mouse pointer and then set yeah. the and then set the ver something so, very simple just to get so just so somebody could see the basic idea because once somebody understands the basic idea of cloud variables, mm -hmm. they could do a like between what you showed them they could do a lot of things. Mm -hmm. So because we even talked like it would be interesting if with the two sprites you could detect when they touch mm -hmm. you could do a lot of things yeah. right yeah. So so we need to set set cloud x so. X position. Now we're doing this so that everybody can see it. Yep. Now it's, it might get oogly when the person is on it. Technical term see, again. See, now I know what oogly means. <laughs> yeah, so it's good. a technical term. Yes. It's a technical term. Everybody, yes. every, pretty much everybody uses it. If you go into an office room, they're like, that's oogly. And then you're yeah. like, oh, sorry. I'm going to use that at work tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So um, then it goes... Two. So um, we're going to say forever. The last step is to go to. Oops. Cloud X and Cloud Y. The concepts are very simple, but if you add a lot to it, it seems yeah. like really confusing. Yeah. So again, you just go to the mouse pointer. It sets the cloud variable X position and Y position. Then it just goes to that position. So, so now I can control it. And oh, now cool. um, if if Daddy goes on it. Alright. So. Did you share? Is that public? Uh, I'm gonna make it so. I'm gonna make it so just you can go on it. Okay. He's a because I don't. I want to see. It. I want to see someone. I want to see someone else do it because it'll be cooler for the presentation. Okay. So if username. By the way, he's on my sister's account, so. Eh. His name isn't really Kate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Kate website. Okay. 
everyone, we're back, and, um... Why are we back? I thought we were still recording. Oh, we ran out of time? Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah, because in the free version, there's not... There's not... Um, there's not... Uh, the you can't record over the 15 minutes? Yeah, you can't record over 15 uh, minutes, okay. so... Yeah, we have to, like, <laughs> stop it, put it, be sneaky, and we put it in the eye, we combine the two, then, we get, then you get this masterpiece. <laughs> okay. Hopefully, or it just could be, like, this oogly, like... Oogly, this oogly, yeah. big blob of... Good thing I know what oogly is now. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, um... Can you explain this? Cloud X okay. and cloud Y? So, what we're going to do is we're going to have dad... Well, da our, my dad. Not your dad. That would be kind of <laughs> creepy if he was in my house. <laughs> if your dad was in my house, that would be kind of creepy. But, um... <laughs> But All my right. dad, my dad. So I'm moving the cat around on my computer. How come it's not moving on yours? I don't know. Oh, look, it's. I just typed cloud X, and then I typed cloud Y. Uh, you have to actually make a cloud veritable. Uh, yeah. I wonder if I have enough space. Okay, cloud X, I don't think I do. Okay, I do. And let's pray. Cloud Y. Okay. Oh, I'll just take these away. Okay. Uh, this is weird. It's not deleting. Oh, probably because you're using them? Oh. Oh, yeah, probably. Okay. Yes, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so, okay, so now we're mm -hmm. gonna go cloud. Oh, oh yeah, you didn't make a cloud variable, oh, uh, I don't think. I am very, I don't <laughs> learn a lesson. Like, I, like, good thing I'm watching. Do you. something, yeah. And then wow. check the cloud, right? Okay. Got it. Okay. How can oh, you can tell their cloud variables have the little cloud oh, they next have the to them? Little cloud, little uh, fluffy okay. cloud. Okay. <laughs> fluffy cloud? Yeah, okay. fluffy cloud. If it's not a fluffy cloud, then this is like pointless. Yes. This whole video is trash. <laughs> <laughs> if it's not fluffy, then this whole thing is trash. Right. <laughs> There's no point of even making a video on added <laughs> somehow. Somehow that works. All right. And multiplayer doesn't really work if it's not a cloud variable. Yes. That's what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, because it, it has to store to server. And if it's just on your computer, then it's just on your computer. It's not okay. really multiplayer. Okay, let's see if this works. I, okay. I, All right, I'm going to start it on mine. Okay, now you move and the I'm, mouse. Oh, Yay, I'm, it's moving I'm moving on it. Alone. I know yes. they can't, the audience can't see us. That I'm uh, moving yeah, it, you can see that. Can you verify that I'm moving it, not you? Um, woo. Now you move it. Yay! <laughs> it doesn't work. Uh, kind of because like I'm capturing it, I guess, now? Yeah. Okay. Well, because, yeah, when you move your mouse, okay. then it. So, so then you can see the code. It's proof. It's proof that only that he can do it. So. Should we go back to our other game and wrap it up? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go back to your your play with others. I should really take all these variables away because they're kind of messy. That's why you can look at. They're helpful when you're when you're um when you're doing like. Or you, when you're baking it, so you can see like the you can see if it's actually working. So now on the other one, how do we? So I'm just gonna rename these players. Just because I had oh, it's okay. hard. Yeah, because I, I mean now I can. Okay, I see. Now that we've oh. explained what those are. Yeah. Okay. Oops, I'll so I'll this. refresh my Let's screen. See. You ready? There you go. And okay. then should we run? Um. Well, I'm gonna restart. Log out and go. Okay, are you in? I'm in. Yay. I gotta probably restart. Oh, you have to restart. Yeah. Log button. Oops. Then you have to, Let me restart mine. Oh, right, so we need to go restart. And then I, I sit play. Am uh, I in? Uh, there uh, I am. Okay. Oh, no, I logged out. Uh, okay. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Oh, there we go. Yay. Ah! Hey, don't chasing, chase me. Chasing, chasing. Hey, I'm like, hey. Ooh, I'm chasing you. Ah! Okay, so I want to thank okay. everybody. So for, thanks everybody for watching, and um, if you like to, if you like this tutorial, um, hopefully we'll do more. If, if a lot of people if, uh, comment on it, right? Few, yeah. If, I want to or if you have any questions, right? You can oh yeah, yeah. If, if right? you have any questions at all, um, I I could even add like an annotation with your question, and I could write the answer. Um, or I could just 
answer it in the comments. I mean, yes. So yeah. till next time, right? Because we know I know like uh, as long as there's not like a jillion comments, that right. we can do it. So, like right. that, and I'm sure they're like. And we'll, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Okay. okay. We'll, we'll just try our best we'll not be to fine. make it too good. Okay. Because <laughs> that would be that would be hard. You have to answer all the questions of the world. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, so thanks for watching, everybody, and um, hopefully we'll see you all later.